Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I am doing a review of ColourPop palette. Now this ColourPop palette came out in the holiday season of 2017 and it's called the All I See Is Magic palette. Now I missed out on this palette um, and when I saw it recently, I just fell in love with it and had to have it. So what I did was I went on to a couple of groups that I'm in on my social media sites and I said, hey, if anybody is willing to sell this to me, I would gladly appreciate it. So I'm not sure what the original retail value for this was. I believe people said it was $20 from my research, um, but I did pay $20 to the um, original owner and she never used this. This is a brand new palette. And these, these colors are just so gorgeous, earthy tones, but also got some good Christmassy and shimmery shades. I'm just, I'm just overall very, very happy. So I wanted to get in and swatch these for us. There is no mirror on this palette, but the colors are just beautiful and I love them. So let's get into the first row. So the first row is this matte peachy color and I don't really like the fact that they don't have the names written on the actual by the pans but they are on the back so the first color I'm going to swatch is I believe um go wish and it's an orangey peachy matte the next one I'm going to swatch is called now and zen and it's a pearlescent white color but it ooh, it's actually coming off as like a gold color that's really pretty so the next color I'm going to swatch is this pretty rose goldy color and it's the shade 1111 that's very pretty you can use that as a highlighter too then the fourth color I'm going to swatch for you is this creamy matte like an overall lid, lid color. And that one is called Treat Yourself. And then the last one that I'm going to swatch for you in this row is a tannish light chocolate brown matte called Top Notch. And then those are the shades for that row. And they're very, very pretty neutral, natural um, shades so let's go ahead and wipe that off so i can do the other swatches okay so the next row we have the first color being what's the first color pitter patter and it's like this burgundy plum matte. Yeah, definitely a plum color. Very pretty. The next color is like a bronzy gold shimmer or metallic. And that's called Wishful Winking. Ooh, that's really pretty. Definitely a bronze color. The next color is like a metallic -y shimmer purple. Plum and it's called something special. That's definitely a color. That's something special. Yep, that's gorgeous. I love that. And then the next color is like a metallic -y green in that same kind of finish, and it's called wishful winking. No, twinkle toes. Twinkle toes is the color of this one. Ooh, and it's very a um, chromatic look. So it like plays with your plays with your eyes it's got like green tints in it but also like purple tints in it you know like those mood ring type colors that's what it looks like and then the last shade in that one is another rose goldy type color and that one is called tinsel town so those are the shades and colors in that row so so gorgeous 
I'm already falling in love with this palette and I haven't used it in my eyes. No, I'm not using it on my eyes today. Um, I just got this in the mail today and I was excited to share the swatches with you guys. So I wanted to try that on immediately. So, but I also like my makeup look that I used today. So I didn't want to change that. Okay. So for the last row, I'm going to use my other hand. It's not so dirty. And we're going to go in with this first shade in the last row. It's this really pretty gold color called Never Never. It's very pretty and buttery. Oh, just gorgeous. I loved how that swatched. Very buttery and creamy. Love it. The next color is a sparkly peachy color. But also in a matte finish with sparkle in it. And that one's called Imperial. The next color that I'm going to swatch is a matte tan brown, like a sandy brown. And it's matte. And then the next shade is an orangey, rusty matte color. Very, very pretty. And then the last one in this row, which by the way, the last few, three ones I swatched were, so there was Imperial and then Teacup was the brown one. Big Spoon was that orangey red one. And this last one that's a metallic-y dark brown with a little bit of glitter is called Save It For Later. You definitely see some pretty gold flecks in that. And those are the swatches for the last row. And these, this palette is amazing. The eyeshadow formula for this palette is just absolutely amazing. Um, I'd have to say it's really creamy and buttery and a lot different than some of the other ColourPop palettes that I have reviewed and I, that I also own. So I am really excited to get this palette. Um, for those of you who have this palette and love it, let me know in the comments below um, if you don't have it and currently own it. I know a few places where you can still get this. Um, but there's places like Mercari. And if you check on your um, social media groups, I'm just making it even dirtier. I'm going to have to wash it. But if you look on your social media groups um, and you can possibly see and find out if somebody would be selling it, um, if you have a trusted buyer or whatnot, uh, I recommend getting this palette. It's gorgeous and um it was again for their holiday season for 2017 i wish color pop would relaunch this palette because i believe that a lot more people would be buying it so once again if you like my channel hit subscribe don't forget to hit the bell button so you don't miss a video like if you like my video if you liked this video comment if you liked any of the shades what you're excited about what shades are your favorite if you do have this palette and as always i hope you all stay beautiful and you have a wonderful day bye